Fishing is a dying sport in recreational activity. Kids are more likely to uh, fish on an iPad or on a Wii or on a PlayStation. Fishing can, can bond families. I'd like to revitalize that and, and spark the interest in, in getting people out there on you know, streams and lakes and, and ponds and reservoirs. I didn't feel like there was a whole lot of selection out there. The wheel started turning and, and I started thinking, well, I have some great adventures and, and stories um, and experiences in fishing. So started formulating a story in my head and, and thinking, you know, I can do this. Self-publishing gave me more of a hands-on approach to writing the book and developing the ideas of the book. I felt that one of the only ways to make sure that the book was done the way I wanted it to was for me to be in charge of the ultimate outcome of that book. The scenes of the different fishing locations in the book, there's nine fishing locations, there's nine species of fish, there's nine methodologies by which the fish were caught, and to get all of that to align in an authentic way was the most difficult part, but in the end I feel like it was the most rewarding part because of how authentic I feel the book is. You know, I got my girls together and I read it to them for the first time. I wrote the book for them, so I wanted them to be the first ones to listen to the story and, and, and I wanted to read it to them. It was, it was a fun experience. <laughs>